Hey guys, Davin here from brewbits.com and one of the questions I regularly get asked is about putting corks into bottles. So I thought I would do a quick video whilst I'm bottling up a load of New Zealand Sauvignon Blanc. And the way I tend to do my corking is with a three-handled corker because I just find them uh, a lot easier to use than, than any of the other corkers out there. But more importantly is what I do to the corks before I pop them in my corker. So in my saucepan here, I have got a quarter teaspoon of sodium metabisulfate and I've got um, about a pint of boiling water. And all I've literally done is popped my corks in the saucepan, poured over the pint of boiling water, and I've not really left them to soak as such, um, but just those couple of minutes to, to heat up and to take on a little bit of moisture just makes them so much easier to slide into the bottom. So, so much easier than, than trying to force it in. And then what I tend to do is, once I've finished corking them, I'll leave them for 24 hours stood upright for the corks to set into place. And then I'll lay them down somewhere nice and cool for storage. So as you can see, Quite a nice easy process, especially with this little three handle corker. And as I say, if you like this one, you'll find it on our website. Um, have a go with it. Let me know your thoughts. What do you use for corking? Do you use perhaps just a simple hand corker? If you do, and your corking bottles a lot, or even not a lot, just a few half a dozen, this honestly gives a lot nicer finish than a hand corker. It's so much easier. I'm not putting any effort into corking these at all. So, anyway, this is how I cork my wines.